Hello everyone, welcome to my Laravel Commerce project. In this video, I want to explain how we can create table and migrate our table for our project. First, we need to check our uh, official documentation. As you can see, eloquent or getting started in this tutorial you can in this uh, documentation you can find the basic information about that how we can create models you can create just models or you can create models with the migration we need to create models with the migration like this I want to create my category the first I want to create my category for my project first enter the your the project folder or you can apply in this area but is my table is not flight is category php artist and make model category with the migration we can define as just m of course we just for example with for migration just m for factory just f for seed just s with the small short definition you can use i want to create I am a, uh, it is not, I am at different project. I was in symphony. Okay. Okay, I want to create my category. Category with the migration. Okay, the two files created, one is under model, the one is the under migration. I want to show you, at the model we have a category, I will define some relation, all of the relation I will define in this area, at the future not now, because we don't have another relation table for in for this project now and we have a migration it's created for us migration category you see the last table is category this is our migration file the, it is created for us with the two fields the one is id another one is time timestamp what is timestamp is created at and updated as its timestamp fields the level migration is created for us automatically with this structure i want to define my another my other fields in my migration file if you don't know how we can define your uh, fields in this area you can open another any uh, other migration file these files 
created for us by Laravel framework. Some of them with the Laravel, some of them with the just stream is created for our project. I want to open just user table. I think we have sample. You can you can see definition. Uh, I want to define like this because my field is string also that you can see table string and name and which one we have title keyword description image status okay title if you did, if you don't define any size any length it is mean 255 or you can define like this table and you see you can a lot of you have some selection that you can select string keywords description main image and status so that is for example image can be null also description keyword can be null Status for example, size if enable, disable, true, false, five, six is enough, and we can define maybe like this or not. Or if we have a timestamp, let me check. I think is okay. Status. Hi, ah, parent ID. If you have parent ID, okay. This foreign ID. Because this, I think we can create like this. If you want more information about the uh, uh, migration information, you can under the database migration, you can find information about the migration file creating some information about the this definition I want to show you available columns type that we can define string, char, date. We just define string and the foreign ID like this, as you can see, foreign ID.
it has a relation with any ID. That means it has a relation with any ID. You can check and define from here. If we define, for example, string length of string. Okay, I add all of my fields under my category migration. I want to create my table. For that, before we need to we need to open my SQL my SQL server. First, I want to show you my SQL server that I don't have any category table. The after migration. I can create it is my project as you can see I don't have any category table I want to apply PHP artisan apply this comment Okay, is migrated, migrated my categories table, migrated my categories table under my database. I want to refresh. You see, this is my categories and my structure title title don't have limitation 255 255 size is 6 it's maybe too much title is too much for this or image too much for this but we created like this maybe as future we can change for image path we can define as 100 it's enough but we can do like that Okay, now I created my table. I want to define, I want to manage my table with the admin panel. And I want to create forms and list and edit my category at the, at the next video. Thank you for watching. See you the next video.